This is SportsCenter with L. Duncan and Kevin Nagandi. Hey, welcome in. No time to waste, Kev. We are jam-packed today. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar is here in just a couple of minutes. Less than 24 hours removed from LeBron overtaking his all-time scoring title. Also, Cowboys star C.D. Lamb will join us and break down the challenges for both Super Bowl teams. Plus, what he thinks of Mike McCarthy as the Cowboys' new Play Were you call. trying to get a cowboy to say he was rooting for an eagle? Well, Micah did. That is Emmett not how. Smith did. You know, that's because they don't know what real rivalries are. The rivalry, speaking of which, between basketball powerhouses, UConn and South Carolina, has provided us with many things in the hoop space. Fantastic contests, as evident by last Sunday's clash. Huge numbers in the seats and on TV sets. Household names on the court and with the clipboards. And, of course, the main component for any rivalry, animosity. Coley Harvey has more in tonight's Sports Center Report. Oh, Ryan Clark won Super Bowl 43, and all these years later, he could still suit up right now. Let's go, RC. Anyway, enough about you. <laughs> Let's talk about this Chiefs offense. We all know that everything yeah. really runs through Travis Kelsey. So if you're mm -hmm. Philly's defensive coordinator, Jonathan Gannon, how are you scheming to at the very least slow him down? In the playoffs trailing only Jerry Rice, who has 22. I don't think Kelsey's going to break that record on Sunday, but hey, at least Kevin doesn't either. Um, Ryan Clark, <laughs> on the other side of this matchup, let's talk about the Chiefs defense. They're going to get yeah. their cornerback, Legereus Sneed, back. He cleared concussion protocol. What kind of mm -hmm. impact is he going to make after only taking four snacks in the AFC title game? Listen. Clark is coming back. The good news for the folks behind you is they can continue to wave over your shoulder when you return to the show in just a few minutes. Ryan Clark joining us from downtown Scottsdale. Kev. If you DeMar Hamlin. Named the NFLPA Allen Page Community Award winner. We love to see that. And we love even more that he's going to get that award in person. Absolutely. NBA Countdown.